so you think you can dance uh, hip hop is not hip hop dance. Oh, that is one of my pet peeves. Oh, see, now you're gonna get me on a roll. So, because I'm so passionate about it, I have a really strong opinion. I'm only gonna deal with facts. My opinion doesn't count. Facts is what I only deal with. Whether you, you know, agree with me or don't agree with me or you disagree with somebody else, it's like, I just wanna start the dialogue. I wanna ta start talking about, like, what does it mean to be a hip hop dancer? What does that mean? Straight up, be born breaking, 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 breaking. That is, that is what I, I'm from. The, I'm from the, I'm from the West Coast, and I was taught from all the East Coast original heads that this is what the original four elements are. And when they told me that breaking was the, the original dance of hip hop, I only can go with that. And then, okay, so then I struggle, I struggle with. Um, you know, locking, popping. Popping and locking, all that, we're adopted into hip hop. We're, that's, that's how I looked at it. We're, we're, the, we're the cousins or, and, and the, you know, stuff like that. People are putting all of those things into the word hip hop, and I struggle with that because I ask, I ask you know, people that I look up to, well, what do you think? And they're like, well, it's not hip hop. You, I can't say everything is snowballed into hip hop because you start doing that, that means you're giving, you're giving credit to others that didn't create that and you're taking away other, other people's creativity and cr uh, uh, credit. But when I look at it, I feel like it's all family and so then, I don't know, I'm just so confused. Anything else is like, I call it social dance of hip hop. When it, when, when, when it got to the club, everybody just doing party kind of socially hip hop, but the original dance will always be breaking. You know, I brought up the word hip, commercial hip hop to Pete and he didn't really like that term. There is no commercial hip hop because if you're not doing real hip hop, you, there's no, uh, we do commercial hip hop. No, it's just called, you're just doing choreograph, personalized choreograph routines and, and movement. How did it get from New York b-boying like the essence raw from the streets the real streets, streets to uh you know dance studios because studios right now is only way you can get uh, a lot of these studios are staying open is to say they're teaching hip-hop and and i go to hollywood and i look at all these studios and i look on the board and i say she's not doing hip-hop he's not doing hip-hop she's not doing hip-hop no one is i don't see uh, a breaking up there for the longest time, I, I called my class hip hop because I was teaching the hip hop music and you know that's what I did. And then I realized I wasn't teaching to that anymore. I was teaching like rock music and uh, you know R and B. You know, if you want to do a, a rocking thing in, in choreography, can you do that? Yeah, but make sure you recognize that and let everybody know in your class that's this is what it is and this is from the original set of, of moves from that uh, from from hip hop. Lately, I've been choreographing to like electronic music or uh, uh, choreographed to Sade's new song. It's like, that isn't hip hop. It's not, it's, my, my style isn't jazz. I'm, it's not funk. I don't know what the fuck to call it. Not everything does not fall under hip hop because of uh, the industry right now, that's how they're getting paid. The, the studio wants me to call it something, so I made up a term. I made up alternative funk. I don't, it doesn't mean anything. I'm saying, well, are you teaching breaking? Uh, no. Well, you ain't teaching hip hop, so stop saying it. Just say you're just teaching personalized choreography. There's nothing wrong with that. But I really want to call it Teresa's dance class. And I really think that a lot of people should start calling their classes by their style, just them, because right now it's, it's, it's an individual, unique interpretation of who they are infused with all these different styles. And that's what you get with each person. So each class is so different. So different. This is our downfall as as as, as street dancers, as hip hop heads, or whatever. We all we all sometimes have lip service, and we all we all talking about what we should do. What we need to do is to do it because you got the Nigels, you have the all these people who are producing and writing these shows that don't know anything about real hip hop. But we all, all this community of hip hop dancers and hip hop heads who, are, who have uh, notoriety in this business are not coming together and saying, let's create our own show, let's create our own business, let's do our own thing, let's, co let's, let's corporate ourselves, let's make this money, let's put this real stuff out on TV. But everybody wanna, talk, wanna do lip service. So sometimes we are a hindrance to our dang self that we should get up off the damn couch and start doing instead of saying. Peace.